About 52 miles of border wall proposed for Star County. Where it will go up, a big question up to now. Channel 5's John Paul Barajas explains Customs and Border Protection sent the latest plans to county leaders. John Paul? That proposal with adjustments to limit negative impact was sent last week. CPP is asking county officials to meet their deadline for review on August 24th. We're up to here with people in this country now. For generations, Roberto Escobar's family has lived along the river. He says they need more security. Illegals, drug problems that we have, but it's also going to stop people going from the north side of the border to the south side. Escobar is unlike many of his neighbors, wants the border wall. He's even okay with having his property cut in half by it. More than a year ago, they, they gave us a design, an area where they thought that this wall was going to be, and they asked us for permission to survey those properties. Those plans changed. A wall is still coming, but the exact location is yet to be finalized. We showed Escobar is what CBP's newest proposal looked like. This red line's the river. Mm -hmm. This black line's where they want to put the wall, mm -hmm. the proposed route. And this yellow outlined right there, mm -hmm. outlined in yellow, Roma and Escobaris. Mm -hmm. It's a consultation area. That means they don't know where the wall is going to go through the city, mm -hmm. but they're trying to figure that out. Escobaris admits there is some things the federal government could ask that would be too much. My whole house right here where I'm sitting at, behind that wall, I don't think so. The Star County Industrial Foundation and Customs and Border Protection are working hand in hand to finalize a route. The foundation says they will be giving their feedback to the government by August 24th. We have a meeting at 6.30 this afternoon, and um, supposedly, or I shouldn't say supposedly, I should say I'm imagining that we're going to talk about the wall. On top of gathering community feedback, the foundation's director says they will be submitting their own proposal. That meeting to discuss proposed changes should start about in the next 30 minutes or so. Escobar says he'll let us know what is figured out. Live in Escobar, John Paul Barajas, Channel 5 News at 6.